Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Aries for the month of February, um, more towards the last half of February. Um, you could be experiencing this uh, energy here that I will speak of in the beginning. Um, so it is general and um, will not resonate with each and every one of you who are watching. And if not, check your moon and your rising sign. If you still do not find your messages there, then simply check back in the following week when I put out a new message for your sign. So this can be a previous energy or it can be a brand new message for someone. Presiding above the reading, we have the card of Earth and the star. Um, now the star uh, seems to be riding here right into this uh, earth card. So I feel that there's a wish to perhaps bring stability back to a situation or back into your life. Um, you're in right now this uh, rest and reflection that we see in this uh, four of swords and you can clearly see the monkey is uh, looking back into the uh, into the looking glass so he's looking back like he's looking back to the past so this is what you're doing um, trying to heal from something some sort of news you would be in this state where you are or this uh, this present energy that you would be in, you would be imagining the worst because you're wanting to bring stability back to a situation. Um, you, It's like you keep reflecting on the past, looking to the past. Um, but um, the other person is not talking uh, or you're not talking to them or... It's like, a, because this can go vice versa, but I feel like there's no communication is what I'm trying to say. And you're reflecting back uh, to some sort of confrontation here with this page. And um, maybe uh, in this confrontation, you kind of felt defenseless. Now, this could be you feeling defenseless. Um, blind almost like wondering where this came from and you know why why is this happening um, why is this person kind of attacking me like this uh, what did I do um, this is what there's reflection on you're going back thinking of this and you're holding on to the pain of what was said here Now, this could be you, but it could be the other way around. For some reason, um, you're in a, you're being cautious, being careful. Either you've said something to upset someone or did something that upset someone, and so they stopped talking, or it's the other way around. But for some reason, at this time, you may not feel like it is the right moment to approach them or this is what they are thinking because you have put yourself here in this hanged man mode and when the time is right you will step out of there out of, out of there um out of that uh, energy of waiting because this uh, would indicate somebody who's in that position, um, it, it's a position of their own making. There doesn't seem to be a solution at this time. So they must wait. Somebody was very angry. And we see you see here somebody was very angry this is a card of someone learning something that made them really upset but there could have been confusion around this this could be somebody 
who um, again, it's it's that type of energy where somebody is um, upset and they're speaking their mind or speaking angrily, and the other person may not uh, know fully what this was about. And here they are. At one time, they had a direction here with this relationship, but that is now behind them. They're feeling on edge, looking out onto a dark sky, so they don't have a direction at this time. Feeling alone, lonely, isolated. They've been shut out. So this is you or this is them. Uh, something got off to a false start. Here we are back in the Four of Swords energy. This is a repeating card. And, you know, the heart is, the heart is hurting. The mind is um, maybe imagining the worst, thinking the worst, and feeling shut out in the cold here. So this could be you in that Four of Swords energy, or this could be the other person. But somebody um, is feeling that um, and trying to heal and have themselves in that uh, hangman mode. Um, there's some sort of uh, a feeling or inner knowing that, well, okay, the time is just not right to approach this person. to approach the person that's in the Four of Swords. Continue here. Someone um, with uh, this, with regards to the connection, the connection still felt, but somebody, uh, somebody is really upset or got really upset by something somebody said or did. That's what caused this rift. That's what caused this time apart. So the way ahead right now with the, um, with the original plan is unclear. And it feels like there's no direction and nobody is talking. The battle is over and somebody is upset, their arms crossed, indicating they are unwilling to have a conversation. They don't just don't want to talk about it. They don't want to talk about uh, a new beginning at this time because that's what they're looking at. Their arms are crossed, they're sitting there, the sword is embedded into the rock at their back, and they're looking over here at this new beginning. Well, I just don't want to talk about it right now. So we've got two people looking right now in um, different directions, so they're not, uh, they're not facing each other, they're back to back. So, and we see here the distance between uh, the two people on the Two of Cups. Above, we have the Two of Swords. Now, this is a card of um, trying to find that uh, resolution. It's like a truce. Making peace. But it's, in, and it's coming with the card of fire. So this card being very calm, this card being very intense. It speaks to um, somebody possibly playing with fire or um, like walking on hot coals. Um, somebody did something that really upset the other enough that they are just no longer talking. And and then we have this, um, you see this person here did not get their wish for news. So there's been no, oops, there's, there's been no news here. 
nothing moves and it's like you're each in your own corner and although somebody here um i feel like they're unable to uh to choose a direction because they keep wanting to go back back is 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 where uh, you, you see this person is they're, they're trying to move forward but they're looking back and the motion is just swirling around their feet so uh, this is somebody who's been shut out they're trying to move forward but really what they want and what they desire to manifest is to go back so they can't move forward there's very deep uh, intense emotions here a deep desire to um, um, to to have uh, a new opportunity in with this person from the past but whoever it was who got angry is just not wanting to talk or has not been up until uh, here <laughs> coming around the end of February or in that last part of February I feel you will have news um, so time is not moving right now it's that you know stuck energy um, nobody's talking um, nine of wisdom and the seven of coins is these two cards would think would um, uh, speak of assessing a situation to try to come up with a solution so this most likely um, this is the person who um, who's trying to um, bring peace back to this situation with whomever got upset and shut them out and, and, and you see here they're waiting waiting they're intuitively with the mystic circle um, feeling that they're going to hear from this person so they're waiting um, wanting to make up with this aid of love here wanting to create these new memories with this person from the past that's what this is about and I feel though even even though the other person is not talking they are thinking I feel they are assessing whether they're going to give this another chance or not okay that's where they are right now because they are tempted um, but right now you're in that that choppy water and they are trying to decide you know um, should uh, or can we move this to um, uh, peaceful waters can we have this truce because um, there's a realization here of still um, having that very deep connection these are hidden feelings they're behind the curtains so they have these very deep intense feelings maybe they feel that because of whatever happened here or what they believe went on they may be the one feeling as though perhaps they would be playing with fire but there is no denying the connection and although they may have shut somebody out here they are now considering um, a reconciliation with this person there they are considering a truce here and we see it up here these preside over this and the four of staves in this um, in this deck speaks to welcome news it is romance 
it's indicating that somebody's feelings are mutual. So if you are um, wondering if the person loves you or returns that love, then this card would be saying, yes, they do. And the world, or even for a reconciliation, then yes, they want that reconciliation because it speaks to the other person's feelings as being mutual. So if this is what you are wanting, or this is what you are feeling, then you know this card is saying the other person is feeling the same way. And with this card here, you will have your answer soon. This is coming. This is the good news that is coming. And with the world, this period that you are in now is going to be completing. Now, we began with the wish, and we also have the wish uh, here, or the star, you see, the healing. And this is coming in unexpectedly. So you have two cards here that speak to unexpected news arriving. You do not have this news yet. I feel as though you are missing this person. And this is about a second chance. This is what this news is. And this uh, in this deck is actually a card of strength and um, being strong. And um, maybe it speaks to you and how you have been um, trying to remain strong um, with regards to uh, this waiting period that you are in. And, you know, maybe back here it's like, a, well, it just was not the right time that um, somebody had to heal um, or had to get over whatever was eating at them or had to uh, have this realization before this could happen. But whatever is going on here is happening for a reason. Now, you do have the hand of fate. And so um, this also speaks to faded events and new opportunities. So this really is confirming uh, this new opportunity that is coming in. Protecting treasure is in the reverse. So um, this card says, do you too easily give your loyalties um, to those who have not earned it? This is a time to assess your personal loyalties and discern whether they're being re returned in kind. You may also need to reassess whether you are compromising yourself in any way to achieve um, what is an illusion of safety. This card is asking you to be conscious of the give and take in all relationships and contracts at this time. Follow the leader. This basically is a saying um, to don't wait for someone else to fix your problems. So, um, it says that um, you need to be honest with yourself. You need to speak up. Um, you need to take the lead. You also may be required to divulge something about your past 
so that you can help this other person maybe to see something or to help this situation but you know only you will know what that is but it could be something something you've been keeping secret or this could be something they've been keeping secret depending you know who is who in this energy because you know um, it could be you could be the other person so that is what I have for you um, Aries I hope that this has helped someone and um, I thank you for watching for liking and sharing my videos and for subscribing also thank you to everyone who has donated to my channel i wish you all the best and many blessings <music>